What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome to my current subscribers and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash just the bed to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Cap suicide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, apply. everyone has free will. Only take the messages to resonate. Leave the rest. Uh, free general collective reading. Um, this is one of the downloads that I received when I told you guys I couldn't sleep tonight um, or this morning on Mother's Day. So I'm offloading them all, so hopefully I can get some rest. That's the plan, Sam. Just saying. Um, thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. We're at 12,430 subscribers right now. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel, 12,430. So I truly appreciate all the love and support. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess to Five. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash out, no Venmo. It's private, very private, confidential way to donate. I do not publicly display your name. Uh, if you choose to don donate through my PayPal, it's a very private, confidential way to donate. Okay, so we're going to just jump into it. Um, the channel message I received was um, someone's third party, um, third party energy. I heard third party energy is about to betray them in a huge way. They have some serious evidence against their um, uh, our situationship. Um, they are about to take it to the police. I heard many negative series of chain events is going to occur uh, for this person. So um, you plug it in, how it resonates. However that resonates, I didn't hear a sign yet or anything like that. Um, I didn't even hear a sign on the third party person about to do this, um, at least not yet. So um, you plug it in, how it resonates. But this could be, I feel it could be your third party. Um, I mean, because, you know, we have 12,430 of you guys on here right now. So it could be. I feel like one of you guys is 12,430 third party energies or somebody you're connected to somebody's third party energy, whether it's yours or somebody you're connected to um, third party energy. There's a reason I'm picking it up is what I'm saying, but they have some kind of evidence on you. So, I mean, it's criminal evidence, whatever it is. I haven't heard specifically what it is. It's some kind of criminal evidence though, but I will tell you this third party energy is pissed at you so much. So, um, they're about to go to the police on your ass, uh, whoever you are. I mean, I, I didn't hear a sign on who it is. They're about to spike out of um, spike because obviously this one, they're a third party energy. I don't, I mean, they're a third party energy. So you could be the third party energy about to go to the police um, on this criminal behavior. I'm all about pro, uh, exposing criminal behavior. Absolutely. Absolutely. But this situation's effed up, and it just really, really is. Um, they're a third-party energy, and they agreed to be a part of the third-party energy, but now it seems like this third party's not getting something from this other person, or they want to spite them and be malicious to them in some type of way, so now they're going to go to the police. Um, so I think it's a fucked-up situation all around the board, to be honest with you. Um, they, In my opinion, they should have never agreed to be a part of a third-party situation. Um, now, I, I've told y'all my story in the past, a long, long, long past ago. It was like 18 years ago when I was dating and I knew my partner had several partners, but I was, I mean, I was a willing third party, but we were all open and honest with each other and there was no criminal activity going on either. So um, not to my knowledge. So, um, you know, but I don't know. I don't, I'm not, I'm trying hard not to judge here is what I'm trying to say. I'm really trying hard not to judge. Kudos to the criminal activity about to be exposed, but I don't understand why this third party energy free willingly decided to get put in this third party energy unless it was about money or greed or spite or maliciousness or something like that. But however that resonates, this person is on the outs, this third party energy, they're pissed at this person. They're pissed at them for some reason. Now, I don't know why. I didn't hear that. But they are pissed at them. So pissed they're about to go to the police because they have some kind of evidence on this person. So not only do they, this third party agree to be a third party, but they knew about criminal activity or activities already. But now they want to go to the police. I heard they're about to go to the police. So I don't know. I don't know. I am not these people. You plug it in how it resonates. I'm trying hard not to judge here. I'm really, really trying hard not to judge. You plug it in, how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else.
This third party energy is definitely not getting what they want now. The police will definitely take this, this evidence. Oh, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. And the rest I heard not to say. Oh, whoa, okay, oh shoot, okay. I heard the police will definitely take the evidence, but the rest of the message I heard not to say, and I understand why. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. Okay. So the police will definitely take, oh, the police will definitely take the evidence. Um, they will. They will from the third party energy. Um, it's some kind of significant evidence of crime or crimes on, I think, their current sexual partner or recent past sexual partner that they have free willingly put themselves in a third party with. Um, they will take it. The, I heard the police will take it, but the rest of the message, I'm not delivering it. I'm not. I was told by Spirit not to deliver it, and I know why not to deliver it. Um, but the police will take it. That's the important part. The police will take the evidence. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. We're going to keep going. Oh, my Lord. I feel guided to get Kipper. Oh, Lord. Toll and labor reversed. Number 38 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 38, it could be a possible age of viewers, somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible day of birth number, possible green card number, possible jersey number. Number 38. It is a feminine energy about to take this evidence to the police on a masculine energy. Know this. Okay, I heard it's a fem energy about to take this evidence to the police on a masculine energy. Know this. So... This third party energy, free willing third party energy over here is a fem energy. Um, they're all, I mean, obviously they are pissed at this person, on the outs with this person, but the person and the evidence they're about to take to the police on their third party, free willing third party energy over here is a masculine energy. So it's a fem energy about to take this evidence on her lover or former lover, um, third party energy, masculine energy. So you plug it in how it resonates, how that resonates. And she's going to go to the police with it. I heard the police will definitely take it. So I think it's something very substantial. Um, it's definitely something very substantial. Just saying, just saying. Oof. Okay. Toilet totally reversed. This feminine energy was hoping they would never have to work again. They have been not having to work for a while, but through series of chain of events, they're going to have to go get back out in the workforce. It's going to piss them off. Okay, I heard this feminine energy was hoping to never have to work again, but through series of chain of events, and I heard she's not having to work right now. So she's not having to work right now. She's told labor reversed. I heard she was hoping to never have to work again. I think this masculine energy is very wealthy or used to be very wealthy, but he's criminal. He's definitely criminal. So I think he has done criminal things or he's doing criminal things or however that resonates. But I think that's why she free willingly put herself in this third party situation is what I'm trying to say for the money. Um, for the money is exactly what I think. Um, this is her hoping to never have to work again. But I heard through a series of chain events, she's going to have to get out in the workforce soon. And she's not going to be happy about it. So right now, in the current energetic space, if this resonates for you, third party feminine energy that's about to go to the police, you are totally reversed. You're not having to work. But I think it's because you're getting money from him. Or you have gotten money from him. Or there's some kind of financial benefit being with him. Um, maybe he pays you for sex, possibly. For some, I didn't hear he did. But for some, I feel he might. I think he might pay you for prostitution services. And um, that's why you don't have to work. Or he financially provides for you because he's very wealthy. How that resonates. But like a mistress energy. I'm feeling mistress energy or prostitution. Which mistress and prostitution is basically the same thing. But you plug it in how it resonates. And I'm serious, for real. But through many series of chain events, I heard you're about to have to get out in the workforce soon and you ain't going to like it. So you don't like working in the workforce. You don't like, it sounds like you don't mind giving up sex um, and uh, booty for some money, basically. And I hate to say it like that, but I mean, I don't know how else to say it. And I'm just being for real. So this is you not having to work right now. In some of these situations, maybe he doesn't have to work. Um, 
definitely think he's paying you for sex. I definitely think he's paying you for sex. Or, or you're his, well, you're his mistress, prostitute, or something. However that resonates. Spirit messages. Okay. Adjudication reversed. Message upright. Number 30 or 7 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 30 or 7. It could be possible ages of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible age of a child, possibly, of yours or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number. Possible day birth number. Possible green card number. Possible jersey number. 30 or 7. Adjudication reverse. Message upright. This masculine energy was really, really hoping not to have a run-in, another run-in with the police, but it is about to really, really go the other way. She is definitely about to make this happen. She's about to make your life a living hell because she's not getting what she wants. Oh, dear Lord. Wow. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Okay, masculine energy, if this is you. You, if you know it's you or feel it's you or however this resonates, you plug yourself in where you fit if you do fit, okay? But this masculine energy, if this resonates for you, I heard basically she definitely is about to go to the police. She has something hard cold on your ass. I'll t I, Trust me. She's got something hard cold on your ass. She's about to use it, and she knows she's got something hard cold on your ass. But she, you have been financially supporting her. Just for real, you have. So much so she hasn't had to work. I mean, damn. Just saying, just saying. Must be nice. Um, but, I mean, don't get me wrong. I love doing this. Uh, this is my business. I work out for 3D. I don't mind working. But this chickadoo apparently doesn't like working. And that's just the truth. But she, um, she's got something very, very substantial on you. I was hoping, uh, you, I heard you were hoping you didn't have another run-in with the law. So you've had run-ins with the law in the past, either one run-in or two plus run-ins. But I heard it's about not to be the case. So your energy is adjudication reversed. You were hoping not to have another run-in with the law. But she is about to create a series of chain events for you because I heard specifically she's not getting what she wants. So she's going to take this evidence to the police and create negative series of chain events for you, which is going to make it turn jud um, adjudication upright. I feel court date energy. I feel law energy. I, um, I didn't hear arrest or anything like that, but it might be arrest. It might be court dates. I mean, legal, legal, legal energy. It hasn't happened yet because you were hoping that it didn't, but it through many series of chain events, she is about to create over here with this very substantial evidence. It is about to turn that way. Is what I'm feeling. So you plug it in, how it resonates. We got message on top on the bottom of that. So I think she's about to communicate with the police with this evidence. We heard in here that she was. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Dear God Almighty, man. Let me see if I hear anything else. This is too damn much. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. I didn't hear anything else. But we have coffin underneath that, so something's about to be put to an end. I think this relationship's about to be put to an end, whether it's prostitution or, well, prostitution or mistress type energy, or you just giving her money, giving her money, giving her money, giving her money. Um, I think this is about to be put to an end because she's about to betray you in such a huge way. I mean, she's about to get you in trouble with the law again. For whoever you are, masculine energy, you've had a run in with the law at least one time in the past. For some, it could be two plus. Um, but it's about to be because you're a third party mistress or prostitute or something. How that resonates? Um, how that resonates in one's life? But it's she's about to create these series of Jane events to make it happen. About to put an end to, I guess, your no non run ins with the law. And the I think it's about to dead this shit because how and well, you could choose to stay, stay in some kind of sexual relationship with her and give her financial support. Yazzie, 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 but why would you want to? 
That doesn't make no damn sense. But of course, everybody has free will and you can do what you want. But coffin cards on the bottom of that. For some, you could be a Scorpio where she could be a Scorpio. I feel you could be a Scorpio, have Scorpio in your chart. She could be a Scorpio or have Scorpio in her chart. Or maybe the person she's about to communicate with in the law enforcement community is a Scorpio or have Scorpio in their chart. But we have coffin card, which is Scorpio on energy. Definite um, endings of cycles here. I will tell you that. Completions of something. For some, the evidence, well, never mind. Let me see if I hear anything else. For one particular situation, this evidence is over a death of the past. Okay. I heard in one of these situations, the evidence is over a death of the past. So she has evidence on you. I, I did, um, some kind of evidence of a death of the past. So I don't know if you kill, physically killed somebody, masculine energy, or you were an accomplice to kill somebody, or you knew somebody that killed somebody, or... You left somebody for dead or something, but somehow a death of the past is significant in one of these evidential type messages and evidence she's about to display to the police. However, that resonates in one's life. Holy shit. Oh, I'm getting out of here. Let me see if I hear anything else. Oof. Okay, I didn't. I'm getting out of this. All right. Love you guys. Namaste.